Hello, Owl fans, and welcome to Brooklyn. I'm Becca Hendrickson here alongside Rocco DeSangro for the Sports Desk. And for the first time in three years, Temple is back at the Big Dance. We're here at the Barclays Center for the NCAA tournament. Rocco, we remember the magic that Khalif Wyatt brought to this stage three years ago. <laughs> Who is it going to be today for the Owls? That was a magical season, first of all, with Khalif Wyatt. Temple really misses him. And the guy that needs to step up today is Obi Anechionia. Started off the game two of two shooting against Connecticut. Looked like a hot start for him, five points. Finished the game two of 13. Very cold ending to Obi's game, and he really needs to heat up in this game if Temple wants any chance of winning today, Becca. And he's got a hard matchup for him on the court today. Iowa has a player in Jared Utah who, to put it simply, is just a stud on the floor, and Obi's yeah. going to have to contain him. Absolutely. Jared Utah, Aaron McKee put him in the same talks as Dirk Nowitzki because he has the ability to step back and hit that three, and then he can kill you down low, take the ball inside. So Obi's going to have to be all over this guy today because if you give him any space, he averages almost 19 points a game. He's lethal. And Iowa is actually a sliding team. They've been ranked as high as third in the nation, mm -hmm. but lately they've lost six of their last eight. Now yeah. anything can happen in March. There are only a couple players on Temple's team who have ever even seen an NCAA tournament, and only one player who's ever played in one, and that's Jalen Bond, who yeah. played when he was back in Texas. Yeah, Jalen Bond back in Texas. Two other guys, Quinn DeCozzi and Devontae Watson, were with Temple when they made that run with Khalif Wyatt, but they didn't get any minutes. But all three guys have experienced Jalen the most, obviously, because he played. But we'll have to look for those two, two, two of the three guys because Devontae isn't getting the most playing time. But DeCozzi and Jalen are really going to have to have big games today. We'll have to see if there's any magic left for the Owls here in Brooklyn. For Rocco DeSangro, I'm Becca Hendrickson. We'll see you at tip-off, Owl fans.